Seek recognition. Without objection, the gentlewoman is recognized for one minute. Madam Speaker, I rise today to speak out against the horrifying human rights abuses that our administration fails to confront. There are more than 1.3 million Rohingya refugees who have fled the genocide in Burma. About half a million were driven out by deliberate coordinated campaign by the Burmese state to destroy the Rohingya villages. According to Human Rights Watch, refugees who arrived in Bangladesh in 2018 reported continued abuses by the Burmese security forces, including killings, arson, enforced disappearances, extortion, severe restrictions on movement, and lack of food and health care. They also report sexual violence and abductions of women and girls in villages and at checkpoints along the route to Bangladesh. Returnees to Myanmar face arrest and torture by authorities. There are more than 128,000 Rohingya still in detention camps where they have been confined since 2012. At, the, at its peak, Rohingya refugee resettlement in the United States was 2,573 refugees in year 2015. That number has dropped to just 207 in 2019. We are supporting the Rohingya refugees expired. through funding programs in refugee camps, but we must do more and help them resettle here in the United States. Madam Speaker, I yield back. For what purpose does the gentleman from Florida seek recognition? I seek unanimous consent to address the House.